Valley that had become ground zero for illegal dumping was filling North Omaha yards with trash. Well, frustrated neighbors called KETV Investigates for help, but tonight we're learning this is part of a bigger trash trend that the Department of Transportation is seeing here in the metro. KETV News Watch Evans Jessica Perez finds out what's being done to clean up our streets. Jim Laughlin with the Department of Transportation says since 2020, he's seen litter on interstates increase about 30%. If you've seen it in the back of a pickup truck, I've picked it up off the road. Four inmate crews work to pick up trash along interstates. Laughlin says crews fill eight to 10 yard dumpsters every week, but it's not enough. I don't have a solution, I wish I did. He says the responsibility needs to fall on the community. People stop littering. Within the city, Lieutenant Owen Gregg says he knows trash is an issue. Omaha police officers do regular patrols of known areas for dumping. This affects the community. You know, this affects your hardworking Joe and Jane who are out there doing doing work every day. They want their neighborhood clean just like you and I do. He says officers go after repeat offenders leaving large amounts of trash. But there's a small number of citations. In 2022, OPD cited 12 people for illegal dumping. This year, no one's been cited. Lieutenant Gregg says the biggest barrier to enforcing trash laws is gathering enough evidence. You try to make your case, but if we don't have probable cause to make an arrest. We're not going to make that arrest. Lieutenant Gregg says community members can help with this by calling police, especially if they catch someone in the act. Even if citizens don't feel like their their complaint rises to the level of police attention, like they, they say, oh, you know, the police are busy, uh, you know, they have better things to worry about. Uh, that's not true. We're here to help our community. We're here to serve the community. Jessica Perez, KTV News Watch 7.